Hey guys, so today I wanted to show you some techniques in iMovie 09 so that you can do some precision editing uh, frame by frame to customize your video and get the exact look and feel from a video that you're after. So why don't we just jump right in. You can see up in my project window I have um, already pre-selected a number of clips uh, to my video. I've added some titles and some background music to the video. Um, and down below you can see the original clips are still showing. So when I play my video, for example, this is a home tour that I did and um, this initial clip is showing the kitchen cabinets and the kitchen countertops on this shot it's showing the island let me just take a look at that shot real quick okay and you can see that back here it really cuts off too early and you don't get a good sense of the island so I want to do some precision editing to get a better look um, at the island and expand the clip in my um, shot so when you click on the clip itself, you'll notice there's a drop-down menu over to the left in the bottom right hand, bottom left-hand corner. Um, and when you double-click on that, actually, it brings up the inspector window, but it doesn't show you the precision editing. So use the drop-down; that'll give you the precision editor. Okay, and then a new window shows up below in the bottom half of your screen. So go to the point in your video up above that you want to edit. Then you can drop down to the precision editing window and now you have much better precise control. And you can even further um, narrow in or focus in on certain frames by zooming over in the bottom right hand corner um, on your actual clip. But let's just uh, show you, for example, what I can do here. So here I've got my um, frame selection. You can see the seconds. And as you drag the window off to the right, it extends the clip. So you can see up above now, I'm getting a better, fuller shot of the kitchen island uh, that I've been working on here. And it wraps around to the bottom. So let's see. Let's extend that from 2.7 seconds out to about... 5.8 there we go now I've given a lot better shot of that cabinet and you can go ahead back up to the top and play that back good okay so I'm done with that let's go ahead and preview my video again up top there we go. And now I get a much better um, shot that includes more of the original clip in my finished video. So there's some other um, precision editing you can do. You can do it with audio too. In this case it's called Clip Trimmer. And um, it brings up the win window below again. And here you can cut off uh, some of your audio. This is really good for voiceovers if you're using um, your video for one source and your audio for another and you need to marry the two together here you can um, designate specifically where you want the audio to begin and end so that's also a very useful tool so precision editing in iMovie 08 or 09 is very straightforward um, it's just one of those tools that's kind of hidden so I encourage you to explore that and I think it'll help make your videos a lot better take care and I'll talk to you soon bye bye